Hey, Jason and Sarah, here's the deal. I'm at 108 Charles Street right now up here uh, in, in Falmouth, and uh, we just took a look at the house. Um, the people are in the middle of moving out, so it's not moved out yet. Just to let you know, you got two parking spots out front. Lynn's gonna pan left and right. Take a look at the place so you can see it. We'll do a look on the inside. The place, just to let you know, if you were interested in it, it's gonna need a good professional cleaning. And it is a short sale. Okay, as we come in, we've got tile floors. I want to point out here that, you know, the things as far as that would need fixing would be where they hung pictures and stuff that would be, need to be repaired. Uh, you've got laminate floors, and this is which would be one of the bedrooms that they're calling a bedroom. Right next to it, we've got tile on the floor in the bathroom. Bathroom with a shower, not a bathtub. As you can see, like I said, they're still moving out. Laminate floor in here through the kitchen. And I'll get Lynn to do this part right here as far as we got a fridge in here. This is the downstairs side. The actual stove, everything else is upstairs. I think this is just where they stashed it. Is it locked from the inside? No. Hmm. Okay. Well, we'll take a look through the window here real quick. A big shed. Yep, you got a big shed out back. You don't have to mow. No grass. Your air conditioner's got some age on it. It's probably a 12-year-old air conditioner. So just want to let you know that. There's some things that you'd have to overcome here, like where they have the mounts for their televisions and stuff. I don't know uh, if they're going to take that and fix it, but I just wanted to point that out. You've got the ceilings with the, uh, the accent to the ceilings. It's not a popcorn ceiling. It's not, you know, asbestos or anything like that, but it's just, it's just uh, a little different. I guess this is the laundry, yeah. Laundry downstairs. Washing dry hookup. Yep. We're gonna head up the stairs. This carpet's gonna need, like I said, when before we came in, it's gonna need professional cleaning. And you can smell that they had a cat in this house when we get upstairs. Yeah, cat urine. Smell vision. The current occupant was a uh, smoker, but they smoked outside. Gas fireplace. Nice room up here, really. With a bathroom off to the left. Family room area. Really smell in here. Into the kitchen. Now the kitchen's neat. As you notice, you got a nice black splash. You do have your granite countertops, all that stuff. The appliances aren't that old. They probably uh, weren't the originals. Uh, but you know, they got some age on them, probably six, eight years old. Um, but tile floors. And over here, as you come into the, what would be an area to eat at, this is actual hardwood oak flooring. Now, you take a step out on the deck. And if you want to just scan over the side there, honey. Like where the shed is? Yeah. Yeah, big shed, Jason. Big shed. Huge shed. Big shed. Takes up the whole backyard. And uh, by the way, if you didn't get that, it's a uh, big shed. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And it's a track track floor. Uh, no, it's actual wood with just the uh, non-skin on top of it. Oh, okay, wood with non-skin. So, but it doesn't look bad. I looked at it down there when we got out there before, and it uh, didn't seem to have anything tearing it up as far as bugs go. That yeah, that's fine. Just close it. Okay. okay. We're gonna go upstairs to the third floor. Got a couple of bedrooms up there and a Jack and Jill bathroom. Whoop whoop. Yeah, 
bedroom number one. And as you'll notice, this might have been where the cat lived at because he left a little bit of his hair here. Jack and Jill bathroom. Over into the other bedroom. Okay, so let me bring you up on the highlights on this. Good schools, you've got uh, your middle schools, Dixon Smith, which is high, highly rated, Stafford High School, which is really good, $71 a month as far as the HOA goes, which is, you know, comparable for around here. It's listed at $200, but like I said, it's a short sale, so that's something to think about. I give the house um, a 7 or an 8 out of 10 as far as I like it, but just like Glenn and I were talking before I got on the video, there's got to be a couple of things done here. You'd have to bring in a professional cleaning service to clean it top to bottom and probably do some painting. But those would be the things that I'd just point out to you when we start off. Oh, the other thing I needed to point out to you is you notice this says Truxton on it. Okay, you know, Truxton, like Admiral Truxton, like practice with daily with guns Truxton. This forehead's rentable. It could say Barry on it at any given time. Just wanted to point that out to you. Other than that, have a great day. Sarah, take care of him because he needs as much help as he can get. And Elijah, we'll see you again someday soon. Oh, yeah, and Jason, if you're willing to wait three to six months for the property. Okay, Oh, yeah, 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 short sale is the only thing that's short is the price that they're paying the bank.